Hello everyone, I'm Steve Lake. Welcome to another edition of The Happiness Factor. For this week's challenge, I've asked my friends to write a thank you letter to someone they wish to acknowledge for their kindness and express gratitude towards in writing. Studies have shown that in the short term, expressing feelings of gratitude is a highly effective way of increasing our levels of happiness and well-being. Biochemical research confirms that in addition to producing oxytocin, the happiness hormone, being kind can also increase serotonin, a neurotransmitter that helps regulate mood. Further, spiritual teachers such as Thich Nhat Hanh say that during the time when you are writing a thank you letter, you are nurturing and healing yourself, while at the same time, you are also nurturing and healing the receiver. Individual acts of kindness can have boundless and immeasurable effects beyond the short term as well. Though neuroscience shows that kindness is most beneficial as a practice, so putting it into action needs to be repeated. And that, great news to us, is the premise of this show. So without further ado, let's say hello to my friends. Hi, everyone. How did it go with the challenge this week? Hello. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Next, we have Matty. Hi, Matty. Please tell us about your letter and how it made you feel to write it. Well, I wrote to my teacher, Sri Harold Klemp. Dear Sri Harold, I'm so grateful to you for having appeared in my life. You have given me the most beautiful presents for my daily life. The first one is an ancient love song to God. My life has changed little by little with this very simple practice you teach, which has only one word, you. What happens most of the times is that it gives me a feeling that everything is all right or will be. It feels really good. You have also taught me that in everything I experience, there is something to be learned and it mostly has to do with becoming a better person, kinder, more caring, more giving, more loving. I am most grateful to you. Thank you so much. Great letter. Oh, cool. That's really nice. Very nice. I really enjoyed this exercise. Thank you for setting it. It feels great to know that I've thanked Sir Harold for, for his kindness towards me. Thank you, Maddie. Okay, who's next? Lucia, what about you? Who did you write to? Well, Steve, I gave my letter a bit of a twist by writing to all my teachers that I had way back in high school who inspired and motivated me in later life. It meant a lot to me that these young people should have found the strength to leave their own country and comfort zone to travel halfway through the world to come teach me the Cambridge syllabus as a teenager in Latin America. Later, I was able to draw up the courage and make the move myself to the US. And I've, uh, I really felt the support as I was adapting to living away from my family in a new country, in a new culture, and a new way of looking at the world. So thank you to all my intrepid high school teachers. Awesome, Lucia, thank you very much. I guess we just don't realize at the time what kind of impact our actions have on others, right? Great. Okay, who's next? Tanya, did you complete the task? I did, Steve. I wrote to someone who helped me indirectly. And here's my letter, so I'll read it. <clears throat> Dear Pitu, you might not even be aware of this, but you played an important role during my teenage years, and I just wanted to acknowledge and thank you for that. Not only is it clear that Jacqueline might not have been able to take me under her wing and give me my first job at Ultra Films had it not been for your support, but also who knows where I could have ended up during those turbulent times when my own parents were going through such insurmountable challenges 
were it not for you and your agreements to give me shelter at your own home. No amount of thanks can express my gratitude for having contributed so generously to my safety and welfare. So please know that you will always have a home in my heart and it's also rent free. Thanks again, Pitu. That was very moving. Thank you, Tanya. So what about now? How do you feel? Yeah, it's great to acknowledge people, to let them know you appreciate something they did or said that helped you, even if it was a long time ago. We remember when people are kind to us. As the French proverb says, write injuries in sand, kindnesses in marble, right? Absolutely. And the Greek one, unfading are the gardens of kindness. And the Russian one, a kind word is like a spring day. And the Persian one, with the sweet tongue of kindness, you can drag an elephant by a hair. And the Japanese one, one kind word can warm three winter months. Yes, indeedy. Well, thank you very much, guys. That was awesome. And that just about wraps it up for us here at The Happiness Factor. Stay tuned for next week's challenge when I'll be asking my friends to speak about a series of mindfulness guided meditation sessions they were asked to attend. And I'll be joined here in the studio by scientists who will show us the amazing results of these simple practices. What about you? Have you been following our challenges? Please let us know what outcomes you've experienced by commenting below. We'd love to hear from you. So until next time, it's goodbye from us. Bye. Yeah. Bye. 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 Hi. And let's just fingers crossed. I've done what's needed and this will work this time. And and you know you'll be you'll be happy that you did this, you know, give it a year or two. And you'll look back and say, oh yeah, that video Tanya made us make. enjoyed this Indeed. <laughs> Absolutely right. Thank you for spotting that continuity. Um, that Good continuity catch. Glitch. Yes. Glitch. 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 Okay, I just saw a movie where the guy is about to jump off a plane or a parachute. And they have the take from the front and he has the goggles on. But then they have a take from the side and he has the goggles over here. Oh. And then the goggles on and the goggles <laughs> over here. <laughs> It went like three different times. They're massive. Anyway. <laughs> Next. Uh, so gather rates. You're working with professionals. What did you expect? <laughs> <laughs> hey. Well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's going to be perfect. 